10. Colosseum The Colosseum is probably the most famous landmark in Rome. Built in the 1st century AD, this great arena could seat 45,000 spectators and was the largest Roman amphitheater in the world. It hosted gladiatorial combats, spectacles with wild beasts, and possibly the execution of early Christians. Throughout the Middle Ages, the Colosseum was believed to be a place of martyrdom and was therefore regarded as a sacred place. 9. Christ the Redeemer Christ the Redeemer, Portuguese, Cristo Redentor, is a statue of Jesus Christ in Rio de Janeiro, Brazil, considered the largest Art Deco statue in the world and the fifth largest statue of Jesus in the world. It is 39.6 meters, 130 feet, tall, including its 9.5 meters, 31 feet, pedestal, and 30 meters, 98 feet, wide. It weighs 635 tons, 625 long, 700 short tons, and is located at the peak of the 700 meter, 2,300 feet, Corcovado Mountain in the Tijuca Forest National Park overlooking the city. A symbol of Brazilian Christianity, the statue has become an icon for Rio de Janeiro and Brazil. It is made of reinforced concrete and soapstone, and was constructed between 1922 and 1931. 8. Acropolis. Acropolis means high city in Greek, literally city on the extremity and is usually translated into English as citadel, akros, akron, edge, extremity, plus polis, city, pl acropolis. For purposes of defense, early people naturally chose elevated ground to build a new settlement, frequently a hill, with precipitous sides. In many parts of the world, these early citadels became the nuclei of large cities, which grew up on the surrounding lower ground, such as modern Rome, the word Acropolis. Although Greek in origin and associated primarily with the Greek cities Athens, Argos, Thebes, and Corinth, with its Acrocorinth, may be applied generically to all such citadels, including Rome, Jerusalem, Celtic Bratislava, many in Asia Minor, or even Castle Rock in Edinburgh. An example in Ireland is the Rock of Cashel. 7. Alhambra The Alhambra in Granada, Spain, is so much more than architecture and history, it is an overwhelming feeling. From the moment you start climbing the small hill, which leads us to what I would like the gates to heaven or to our final resting place to look like, our bodies are invaded with new feelings and emotions. It is probable that many of us who are interested in the Alhambra have seen beautiful pictures of it, but when you are coming closer, the magnificence of its physical aspect seeming to touch the deep grenadine sky together with originality is breathtaking. Every day since its beginning as a castle in the 9th century, the Alhambra has lived memorable moments, both historic and passionate ones, and these sensations lived years ago are the ones which reach our most inner soul, causing us to tingling, trembling, and even flurry. Six, Padala Palace, Padala Palace, Lhasa, Tibet. The old Padala Palace was built in 7th century. At that time, Jampu King, Shuzhen Gumpu, established Tufan Kingdom in Tibet, Lhasa was its capital, the emperor of China's Tam Dynasty sent Princess Wenchen to marry Jampu King, Jampu King decided to build a city to show the glory, then started to build Padala Palace on the Red Hill. There were 1,000 rooms in it, however the old palace was destroyed during the war. The present Padala Palace was rebuilt major after 17th century, particular during Dalai Lama V period. The present Padala Palace is 119 meters height with 13 floors. It is famous for its high historical value and kept numerous treasure in it. 5. Persepolis Persepolis consists of the remains of several monumental buildings on a vast artificial stone terrace about 450 by 300 m, 1480 by 1000 feet. A double staircase, wide and shallow enough for horses to climb, led from the plains, below, to the top of the terrace. At the head of the staircase, visitors passed through the Gate of Xerxes, a gatehouse guarded by enormous carved stone bowls. 4. Stonehenge Stonehenge is a prehistoric monument located in the English county of Wiltshire, about 2.0 miles, 3.2 kilometers, west of Amesbury and 8 miles, 13 kilometers, north of Salisbury. One of the most famous sites in the world, Stonehenge is composed of a circular setting of large standing stones set within earthworks. 
It is at the center of the most dense complex of Neolithic and Bronze Age monuments in England, including several hundred burial mounds. Archaeologists believe the iconic stone monument was constructed anywhere from 300 BC to 2000 BC. As described in the chronology below, radiocarbon dating in 2008 suggested that the first stones were erected in 2400 to 2200 BC, whilst another theory suggests that bluestones may have been erected at the site as early as 3000 BC, see phase 1 below. The surrounding circular earth bank and ditch, which constitute the earliest phase of the monument, have been dated to about 3100 BC. The site and its surroundings were added to the UNESCO's list of World Heritage Sites in 1986 in a co-listing with Avabari Henge Monument. It is a national legally protected scheduled ancient monument. Stonehenge is owned by the Crown and managed by English Heritage, while the surrounding land is owned by the National Trust. 3. The Great Pyramid of Giza The Pyramids of Giza are the only surviving ancient wonder of the world and one of the most famous tourist attractions in the modern world. They are some of the oldest sacred sites in our index and certainly among of the most impressive. Although it is clear the pyramids were used for the burial of pharaohs, the construction, date, and possible symbolism of the Giza pyramids are still not entirely understood. This mystery only adds to the attractiveness of these ancient wonders and many modern people still regard Giza as a spiritual place. A number of fascinating theories have been offered to explain the mystery of the pyramids, one of which is summarized below, Giza is the most important site on earth for many New Age followers who are drawn by the pyramids' mysteries and ancient origins. Since 1990, private groups have been allowed into the Great Pyramid, and the majority of these have been seekers of the mystical aspects of the site. But even the most skeptical visitor cannot help but be awed by the great age, grand scale and harmonic mathematics of the pyramids of Giza. 2. Machu Picchu The ruins of Machu Picchu, rediscovered in 1911 by Yale archaeologist Hiram Bingham, are one of the most beautiful and enigmatic ancient sites in the world. While the Inca people certainly used the Andean mountaintop, 9,060 feet elevation, erecting many hundreds of stone structures from the early 1400s, legends and myths indicate that Machu Picchu, meaning Old Peak in the Quechua language, was revered as a sacred place from a far earlier time. Whatever its origins. The Inca turned the site into a small, five square miles, but extraordinary city. Invisible from below and completely self-contained, surrounded by agricultural terraces sufficient to feed the population and watered by natural springs, Machu Picchu seems to have been utilized by the Inca as a secret ceremonial city. 1. Petra, Petra, Petra meaning, rock, is a historical and archaeological city in the Jordanian governorate of Mon that is famous for its rock-cut architecture and water conduit system. Established sometime around the 6th century BC as the capital city of the Nabataeans, it is a symbol of Jordan as well as its most visited tourist attraction. It lies on the slope of Mount Hor in a basin among the mountains which form the eastern flank of Araba, Wadi Araba, the large valley running from the Dead Sea to the Gulf of Aqaba. Petra has been a UNESCO World Heritage Site since 1985.